Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. General TNI Agus Subianto, the commander of the Indonesian Armed Forces, took delivery of a batch of 10 Haramau, Tiger, medium tanks. The development of these tanks was initiated by FNSS, Turkey, and PT Pindad, Indonesia, as part of the modern medium-weight tank, MMWT, project, in response to a request from the Indonesian Army for a new three-man medium tank. In May 2015, Indonesia and Turkey agreed to jointly develop the MMWT, with a projected development phase of up to 37 months and a budget of $30 million. The collaboration involved constructing the first prototype in Turkey and the second in Indonesia, with shared intellectual property rights for the design. The initial model of the tank was unveiled during the 2016 Indo Defense Expo in Indonesia, showcasing a vehicle weighing approximately 35 tons and equipped with a Belgian made Cockerel 105mm rifled barrel turret capable of firing various projectiles. The first prototype was presented at the Turkish IDF 2017 Expo, featuring different turret types and modular armor for quick replacement if damaged. The MMWT was subsequently renamed Kaplan Mount by Turkey and Harmau Medium Tank by Indonesia, both translating to Tiger. By September 2018, after completing the necessary qualification tests for the Indonesian Army, the tank was approved for mass production, with the initial batch expected to range from 20 to 25 units and an overall production estimated between 200 and 400 units. Mass production officially commenced on February 7, 2020. At the IDF 2021 event, the production model of the Harmau slash Kaplan mount was showcased, incorporating adjustments and enhancements based on user feedback and test results. These improvements included enhancements to driver visibility, handling ergonomics, and modifications to the turret system, power transmission group, cooling system, and suspension system. Following a series of firing and mobility tests conducted in early 2022, the first batch of 10 tanks was completed at the FNSS facility in Turkey. A subsequent batch of 8 tanks is planned for production in Indonesia by PT Pindad, with support from FNSS, continuing the international collaboration. The Haramau is a medium tank developed through collaboration between PT Pindad, Indonesia, and FNSS, Turkey, designed for operational flexibility and suitability for various terrains, including those in the Southeast Asian archipelago. It features a low profile and a suitable power-to-weight ratio, integrating a rear configuration power pack, electronic control systems, an auxiliary power unit, APU, and a heavy-duty suspension system to support operations in diverse battlefield scenarios. For protection, the Haramau incorporates advanced ballistic and mine resistance systems. The interior is designed with crew ergonomics in mind, supporting efficient driving, firing, and ammunition management in various combat conditions. The tank is equipped with day and thermal imaging cameras, a digital driver's dashboard, third-generation sighting systems for the gunner and commander, a battlefield management system, BMS, and a laser warning system, LWS, to enhance situational awareness. Armament includes the Belgian Cockerel 3105 turret housing a high-pressure 105mm Cockerel gun capable of direct and indirect fire. Additional armaments include a NATO standard 105mm rifled gun, a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun, and optional 7.62mm or 12.7mm machine guns, along with smoke grenade dischargers for defensive actions. The Haramau is powered by a diesel engine connected to an electronically controlled transmission ensuring a power-to-weight ratio of at least 20 horsepower slash ton, which can vary with the armor configuration. With a maximum road speed of 70 km per hour and an operational range of 450 km, it is equipped with systems for crew communication, navigation, CBRN protection, and fire extinguishing, complemented by an auxiliary power unit and an advanced battery monitoring system for efficient power management and silent watch capabilities. That's all for now. See you later.